Welcome back to the show. Today we're taking a trip to Pakistan, specifically the Balochistan province. Now, Balochistan is a place of stark beauty, a land of rugged mountains and vast deserts. It's got this raw, untamed vibe like Mother Nature just decided to go wild. But here's the thing, Balochistan is also one of the most arid regions in Pakistan. Rainfall? Forget about it. We're talking less than 10 inches a year, fam. That's drier than a popcorn fart in a sandstorm. And you know what that means, right? It's tough to grow anything out there. I'm talking about a serious agricultural struggle. This lack of water, it's like trying to grow a pineapple in the Sahara Desert. Not happening without some serious intervention. And that's where our story takes a turn. Because Pakistan came up with an ambitious plan. A game changer. They call it the Kachi Canal Project. A massive undertaking aimed at transforming the region. So, what is this Kachi Canal Project, you ask? Well, it's basically a massive engineering feat that aims to quench the thirst of Bulochustan's parched lands. See, there's this river called the Kachi River. It flows down from the Himalayas, carrying precious water that usually just ends up in the Arabian Sea. What a waste, right? The idea behind the project is simple yet brilliant. Divert some of that water from the Kachi River and channel it into the heart of Bulochustan. It's like building a water highway, bringing life-giving liquid to a region that desperately needs it. Section 3. Mapping the Transformation Route and Resources Now this ain't no small-time operation, folks. This is a massive undertaking that requires meticulous planning and execution. We're talking about a canal that stretches over 360 kilometers. That's like driving from New York City to Boston and back. And then some. It starts at the Taunsa Barrage on the Indus River, picks up water from the Kachi River along the way, and then snakes its way through the districts of Dera Bugti, Nasirabad, and Jalmagsi, transforming the landscape as it goes. This is serious infrastructure, people. We're talking about a game changer for the region. And how much is this ambitious project gonna cost? Hold on to your hats, because the estimated budget is around 6 billion US dollars. That's a lot of dough, no doubt, but it's a necessary investment. But think of it as an investment, a down payment on a more prosperous future for Pakistan, bringing hope and opportunities to the region. Section 4, Phases of Progress, Where We Stand. Rome wasn't built in a day, and neither is a mega project like this. The Kachi Canal project is divided into phases each one a significant milestone in its own right. The first phase, which involved constructing the main canal, is already complete. That's right, water is flowing. The next phase focuses on building a network of distributaries and miners, like smaller arteries branching out from the main canal. This will ensure that water reaches every nook and cranny of the targeted areas. Finally, the project also includes the construction of storage tanks and reservoirs to conserve this precious resource. Section 5, A Brighter Future, Cultivating Prosperity and Hope. So what does all this mean for the people of Pakistan? In a word, hope. Hope for a better tomorrow. The Kachi Canal Project has the potential to transform this arid region into a breadbasket, a hub of agricultural activity, and a beacon of progress. We're talking about creating new farmlands, boosting crop production, and generating employment opportunities for countless families. This project is about more than just water. It's about empowerment, especially for women. It's about giving the people of Pakistan the tools they need to build a brighter future for themselves and their children, ensuring long-term sustainability. It's about turning a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity into a legacy of prosperity and hope for generations to come. Stay tuned, folks, because Pakistan is about to bloom like never before.